are very rude. These are very rude. It's only penis. <laughs> Hi guys, it's Holly and as you can see, I'm in a different place today. I am up in Manchester for Tattoo Tea Party. Usually I film the talking segments of my vlogs on a Saturday after I finish work in the shop. But this week I am up in Manchester for the Tea Party Tattoo Convention and it just occurred to me that it is Sunday morning and I've got another really crazy busy day ahead of me and I'm not gonna get another chance to film so I thought I would just do it now while I'm doing my hair. I'm up here for Tattoo Tea Party. Other than that, it has been a busy week in the shop. Um, it feels, you know when you go away and then it feels like forever ago since you were doing your work or like your normal stuff. Like I've only been here for like two days but it feels like I've been here forever. Um, conventions are a bit like that, I guess. You kind of lose all sense of time. Um, so I had a normal nice week in the shop, uh, Fiona was in, we were doing some nice tattoos. And then Matilda helped me pack up all my stuff and I got ready for the convention. Um, my parcel turned up from auction, awesome merchandise and I wanted to show you what's in it. I've had these made for tea party, they're temporary tattoos, so if you remember these from when you were a kid. Oh, I can't do it one-handed. But um, you peel off the top layer and then they're little tattoos of my drawings and, and I've had stickers made. So, oh, it's a bit shiny. These ones and then these ones. So I'm gonna have them on my booth. Um, you got anyone who's not in England that's watching this won't may not know that we've been having crazy weather in England for the last week or so, like crazy amounts of snow. So um, we did have a bit of a mad week with people canceling and then I really thought that I wasn't gonna come to the convention because it's about a th four, three, four hour drive, might closer to four, four hour drive from where um, I live in Bedfordshire to Manchester, which is where the tattoo convention is and it was like lots of the roads were closed, people were getting stuck on the motorway overnight, so it was really touch and go. If you follow me on Instagram, you would have seen me putting up a post asking people like, what are the roads like? Um, because if you watch the news, they make it sound like it's the end of the world and that if you get into your car, you're gonna get stuck in a snowdrift and die. And then people up in Manchester were saying, oh no, the roads are fine. So then you're thinking, well, what's the actual version like somewhere in between? Um, so yeah, I wasn't gonna come, it was all a bit stressful. And then at the last minute, I just thought, you know what, I'm just gonna go because what's the worst thing that's gonna happen is I'm gonna, what, I have to turn around and come home. Um, and in fairness, once I actually did get going, the first hour was really scary. Like, you know, when the snow's coming at your windscreen and um, my car was like getting blown all over the road because I have a very boxy car. Um, so it was quite scary and then the whole time I was thinking oh shit like I shouldn't have done this I should turn around and go back and Then the road cleared and everything was fine and in the end it only took me like four hours to get to Manchester um, And it was fine. So yeah, I'm here now doing the convention. It is Sunday. So I was here all day yesterday my friends at Red's tattoo shop um, they had hosted me on their booth for the weekend. So we had lots of fun uh, I'm gonna insert lots of footage here of the convention uh, so you can guys can kind of see what it's like but I've had a really fun time um, I'm gonna put in some pictures of the tattoos that I've been doing but because it's a convention the lighting is really terrible so everything looks really shiny and pink um, just because of the lighting so yeah sorry about my bad videos so I've been having a great time at the convention. Um, it's very, very noisy. I did plan on doing a bit of filming while I'm at the convention. Um, um, but I filmed a little bit yesterday and it was like unusable, the stuff that I filmed because it's so noisy there. Um, so that's why I've done this bit of filming this morning, just to kind of talk over my videos and tell you what's going on. Um, so yeah, the convention's been great. Um, it's been really fun getting to tattoo you guys and meet you. And I've got another busy day today, so I'm gonna get to meet some more of you. If
So I thought I'd give you a little tour around what the convention is like in the morning before it gets too busy and crazy. So excuse my shaky camera, but I'm just gonna take you on a little tour. Um, during the day when the convention is on, it is impossible for me to get off my booth because it ends up being so busy. Um, so I will film a little bit if I can, but um, yeah, I thought I'd give you a quick look around before the show actually starts. It is, what is it? It's Sunday morning. So we've been here for a day and we're about to do day two. So um, me and my friends now are gonna have a little tour round of the convention and show you what's happening. And look, here's Ashley and Stephanie. Hi. Hi. Yeah, I'm trying to like get everyone in, but I'm really shit at using my camera. Hi. <laughs> How are you guys doing? I know. How nice are they? Yeah. Look, I've got most of my hall in the house. I want to go around um, this evening and pick up some prints. This is some nice oh. ones. So nice and quiet, like you can actually walk around, can't you? Like before the convention starts. Because yeah, later on it's going to be crazy. Because it's funny, you end up stuck on your booth all day, don't you? And you don't get to actually walk around and have a look at it. When I came to the London Tattoo Convention, there was one of these taxidermy booths. Yeah. And they, um, my old boss got really excited. She was like, oh my God, look at the guinea pig, look at the guinea pig. And when I went over to look at it, it was like really flat. It had a really sad face, you know, and you're like, this is just making me happy. I don't like it. <laughs> If you follow me on Instagram, you will, yeah, because I'm speaking from the future, so you will have already seen my Instagram stories that I'm going to be doing today because I'm speaking from the past about the future. Ah, but um, yeah, so that's it for me. Um, uh, normal kind of service will resume next week because I'm back in the shop doing normal shop things. Um, I have, my brain is completely boggled because I'm out of my normal thing I'm trying to think what I've actually got lined up for next week I have no idea so <laughs> you'll just have to play it by ear we'll see what we're doing next week and I hope you've enjoyed this little glimpse around tea party and seeing what a convention is like I think I'm going to put together a little video about more about tattoo conventions and kind of what the setup is and everything because I know some of you guys have been interested to know a bit more about it so I'm going to try and remember today to film that stuff for you so cross your fingers that I remember and um I will see you next time thanks so much for watching bye